uh, people. I, it's interesting, when we show up in Los Angeles, and I go once a year to promote the film and TV industry to make sure people are making more movies and TV shows up here so there'll be lots of jobs for all of you and many more to come. Yay. Um, Woo! We show up with our unions. And they find this most unusual. They kind of say, well, how, how come these people are with you? And he says, well, why wouldn't they be with us? They're part of the team. And they find that unusual, but it's a Canadian thing. As you know, we understand the fact that the unions, for example, and the industry are partners with the government uh, in making sure that this industry uh, succeeds and thrives. And it's been very interesting the last couple of years, they've said to us that the one thing that they're really counting on us, they're counting on us as Torontonians and as Canadians to show that the film industry can be made more inclusive because you know from, from, from the Hollywood end of it, there's been a lot of, and quite properly so, a lot of pushback on the fact that the industry was not in terms of what people would see uh, behind and in front of the camera and up on stage at the different award ceremonies, the kind of representation of uh, the society that, uh, that we're all a part of, especially in North America. And so they look to us here because they know that we get it, and we get it, yes, in part because we should have a program like that for the technology industry to make sure that we start to create the placements and the opportunities uh, for young people who have an interest in technology to take part in that. Ooh, and right. so they're going to do that. Woo! I was just saying that in technology people, I was overseas in London about three weeks ago pitching people to come and make investments in technology in Toronto, and they said to me, well, when we come there, what are we going to find? And I said, well, you're going to find the most talented, but also the most diverse uh, group of people coming out of the different schools uh, anywhere in the world. And, and, and we, we haven't mastered the art of inclusion, but we're working on it. And they are determined to come and see what we're doing here because they face the same challenge. All these other countries have diverse populations, perhaps not as uh, diverse as ours, but they have the same challenge in front of them. That there are groups of people who never had anybody to connect. And I want to finish and have access to those jobs. And the fundamental answer to that question had nothing to do with the talent. In fact, there was a sort of huge uh, surplus of talent that was resident in some of those communities. The fundamental reason was what Vishu said, which is that they, you know, nowadays you can send, we think it's great, you can send your resume in electronically and not have to produce a piece of paper and not have to carry it around anywhere. But in the old days, at the very least, you got to hand that piece of paper to another human being. And if you went back even to the receptionist, you could say, what happened to that piece of paper? Now you send in your resume electronically on the internet, you don't have any idea what happens to it, half the time nobody answers. And in those cases, those moms said to me, we don't have anybody we can call. We know lots of other people have friends they can call and say, could you give my kid a chance in the production business or in the media business? And so we're gonna have to just provide that little bit of a, of a hand up. And I could tell from the people I met walking in this place tonight that that's all it takes. It's just the one little bit of opportunity, the one bit of, of connection, the one bit of uh, self-confidence building and it's going to allow all of you that are graduating and everybody else to be stars in this business and that must be so because otherwise we can't claim that it's an industry that really represents the community in which it's resident but it's also going to be hugely beneficial for the industry in terms of the perspectives it will bring to the stories that are being told and to uh, products that will be exported around the world made by Canadians from all different backgrounds and so I just say thank you for that. And, uh,